All right guys, so here's a little tip for you. I'm gonna try to do this as quick and quietly as possible. My blind is about 25 yards that way. And I'm here in Arkansas, and in Arkansas we can bait, and especially on this property. It's a smaller piece of property. It's hard to pattern the deer. Um, we like to bait on this area. So we like to use nose jammer. And I've been using it for a long time, seven years or more. And the deer, it just jams them. It literally jams their sense of smell and it's a natural smell. They will smell it, but they don't go on alert by it. And so um, what I like to do, if I have the opportunity, because like I said, they will smell it. It's like, it's just a change in their environment from smelling one thing to the next. Um, I always use like the wax stick, like inside my blind and condition my blind to smelling like it. And you can see here, there's corn and stuff here that I've dumped out. Where I'm gonna dump out my bait, I'm either gonna take the wax stick or some spray like this. And I'm just gonna mark some of the trees in the area. What that's doing is conditioning the deer. They get used to that being right here around the feed. If you put it on yourself and you come in here, they are not gonna be alerted by it by any means. I had deer for an hour and a half in front of me, a lot of bucks actually, tonight at uh, 25 yards or less because they were conditioned to not going on alert by this stuff. So check it out, you got nose jammer. I like their wax stick as well. Wax stick is gonna last a long time on these trees around here and I've already got some on it, but I gotta hit you guys up that little tip. Check it out. Won't you take a little